and welcome to more gaming fans. I'm your host Joseph Moore here, and we are finally back with our Through the Regions playthrough. All right, so um, I caught us back up to where we were, and I also decided since we did lose a few members that we would uh, train some up to replace them. So uh, instead of Zigzagoon, we have Bows to fill that empty normal slot. Um, next up, we still have Natsu. We didn't lose him. Then we have Win the Mining. Who we did not lose either. Then Rakishi, who evolved at the end of last episode. Uh, table, our Lombre. Oh, sorry about that. Um, uh, we brought him in because he's a water grass, replaces Grovile, uh, covers our water as well. And then we have uh, Speed Swallow. Um, we had him last time around. That's pretty much it. I just recaught what we didn't have already. And then, uh, let's see. What else? That was it. Give me one second, guys. Sorry. It's hot in here. All right, guys, now we can officially start again. Let's go ahead and go over the two mon. We d technically had four deaths, but I didn't recatch the Pokemon that died. Just, you know, save myself some time getting back to where we're supposed to be. And, uh, yeah, everyone else is there in the box. So let's go ahead and continue on with our journey. Um, I did accidentally do the uh the wind straight house so i mean there's not much to it uh you do that then you get uh you get a whatchamacallit uh, it's not gonna work okay well basically you win that and then you get a uh macho brace i went ahead and give that to rakishi and this guy gives you a repeat ball, the only one in the world. Well, the first one in the world. So now you can start buying repeat balls. Ignore the Wismers. And also, since we did do the favors for the... For the president already. Sorry if I'm breathing weird. I just finished eating, so it's just like, ugh, I'm full. Um, we can get our EXP share now. And I did train up Wismer, but I don't, I'm not really going to train it up now. Just solely for the fact that, uh, I don't want to. <laughs> Alright, let's see if I get some background music going here. Uh... Forgot to do that. Forgot to set that up. So, let's go ahead and get that going. There we go. All right, that should work. If uh, for some reason the sound sounds weird, let me know, guys, and I'll I'll try to adjust. But that should work. I kind of figured out how to do desktop audio as well as my voice audio. Alright, just double checking the audio on my own side. 
welcome everybody to the uh, to the stream. I do have. Uh... Hey Eddie, how's it going? I did add some quick links uh, to the chat. So if you wanted to um, join any of my other things here, uh, there's the uh, there's a link for the podcast. There's a link for my YouTube channel, and then there's the link for the more gaming group where um, we do giveaways and uh, we also get e. Uh, uh, I can't think right now, but yeah, we do giveaways. I talk to uh people firsthand and share some other awesome stuff like the podcast links and youtube videos of draft leagues and whatnot oh man just at work well hopefully works not too much longer but sit back relax and enjoy the soothing sound of my voice that typically can't be that soothing <laughs> But we're going to go ahead and get the Pokemon we actually want leading the team right now. And again, Bose is just like a filler mon. So we're just going to have him kind of hang back. All right. Well, as we continue on the journey here, how's everyone's day going? Hopefully everyone's doing all right. Eddie, I see you're at work, but eh, could be worse. Could be in traffic. <laughs> mm, but I know work cannot be fun. Well, it can be fun, but is it fun? Who knows? Well, I guess you would know, right? Alright, now we can go ahead and make our way this way. And let's see if we get into any battles. Fifteen minutes left on break, and then four hours and fifteen minutes, and then I'm done. Woo! You got a long way to go. You work second shift? I remember those days. I do not enjoy second shift, mainly because it feels like your whole whole day is just wasted, but you you make the be you make the best of it. Alright, Natsu and Lombre are out here. So we're gonna go ahead and fake out the whims the Wismer. Ember the Magnemite. And just so everyone knows, um, the reason you're seeing so many double battles in this game, I don't know if I said this before, I feel like I have, but Gen 3 was the uh, the generation double battles came to fruition. Hey Sammy, how's it going? Just playing some Emerald finally. Finally got everything back and up and running. Got today and this weekend left at the store then they are moving me to a different store as of monday man i hope they give you a day off in between the move all right she's gonna ask us for uh, an interview we're not gonna give it to her oh did i not edit my my thing again jesus Through the regions. Emerald. Owen. And let me go ahead and fix that. Because it's supposed to be Emerald. <laughs> well, it's still Pokemon, right? It counts. There we go. Should be fixed now. Says it was updated. I accidentally battled her too, but we still got this battle going over here. Alright, so we got a sand shrew. Luckily we have a table up front. But we don't have an eight. We don't have Oh man, did I accidentally get rid of Absorb? Well, the last stream was supposed to be D&D &D with the boys, but uh, 
they never showed up so i didn't get to do that yesterday i did a rerun stream of the last uh last episode of this but uh i don't know some people watched it all right i'm gonna switch out here so we got a water grass mod with no grass or water moves that's fantastic all right, poison sting is gonna go ahead and come off again. Ooh, with the critical hit fake out, we take that thing down. Let's see if we have a grass move we can give it. No, we don't. Well, that's gonna suck for the next few <laughs> moments that we have to do deal with that. Let me try to update it one more time. There we go. Now it should be right. So Nuzleaf is going to go ahead and come out. And we got Table coming out here. We got off a of Fake Out. It does a decent amount of damage. Nuzleaf flinches. And let's just go ahead and go for some Nature Powers. Turn it into Swift. So what have y'all guys been up to? Other than Eddie's working. The lady before the first gym gives you bullet seed, I'm pretty sure. Uh, I didn't get it. I don't know if I missed it or what. But as of right now, we're dealing with that. I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of Astonish there. Get ourselves some Fury Swipes and move on to the next battle. Actually, this is a new route. We can go ahead and get a new Pokemon here. Oh, it's been raining. Yeah, it rained the last few days over here. Oh, and we get a Meryl. Meryl! Alright, let's see if we can't capture this Meryl and make it our own. Fake out. Kind of wanted a Numel. Oh, a stun sport because we're in the grass. Well, that kind of helped out. Just don't start rollouting on me. Go ahead and go for the rock smash. Ooh, critical hit, and that's in range to catch now. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I, I try not to do too many of the uh, impressions because they're like sharp, high pitched sounds. But glad I can get a 10 of 10 on that one. And Meryl's going to get in this great ball here. And we caught it. What do we nickname this thing, guys? Pika Blue. Or what's up? What sounds good? Mary, that works. Female, uh, Meryl. I feel like that's in a show somewhere. Mary, female Meryl, named Mary from the anime, I think. I don't know. Oh, and we get another battle here. She wants us to sing with her. That's not going to happen. Need a few more drinks, lady, before I start just... Belt and tunes. Well, welcome, 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 everyone. Mary J. <laughs> well, we already have a Mary Jane in the PC. It's Oddish. All right, Nature Power. Quick attack goes off. Good thing it didn't go for Peck. Swift should be able to take this thing out. Fake Out did quite a bit of damage, and it does. Oh, we got a Lombre coming out against us. And we know just how to deal with those. We're going to bring out Speed. Alright, we're going for the Wing Attack. 
And down goes Lombre without a problem. Man, guys, I've been going to the gym. It's a good thing to never skip leg day, but geez, you really want to sometimes. My legs are sore. All right, Geo Dude comes out, and normally we'd be able to take this thing on no problem. I don't know, but I usually name my Pokemon by what their actual name is. Hey, that makes sense too. I am not good at nicknames. Uh, see, I mean table. Come on, but uh, you know, I, I try to make them somewhat funny sometimes. Unoriginal, so most of the time, but <laughs> I try to make it funny. Jill, dude, goes ahead and gets a rock throw off, and we're gonna go ahead and finish it off with a rock smash. Oh, what did I do? Why? What happened to my absorb? You know what? I leveled it. I leveled up table in the uh, in the what do you call it? The daycare. And I, I leveled it up like six levels just running back and forth because training in the wild around this area was horrible. There was nothing it was super effective against. I think that's what happened. It taught nature power over, over absorbed. Because I know for sure I wouldn't have done that. It was my only answer to rocks. Now I got to rely on rock smash. At least it's super effective, but... <clears throat> Uh-oh. This can't be good. This might not be good. Okay. Whew. We're fine. I thought it was going to do a lot more than that. Blaziken will be Blaze, Swamper will be Swampy, and Sceptile will be Skeppy or Tile. Hey, it's easy to remember, and it's kind of like uh, the anime nicknames. They just kind of add something to their name as well. Like uh, Charizard's girlfriend's Charla and stuff like that. So it makes sense. But what doesn't make sense is why I have no grass or water type moves on this thing. Rock smash of all things are what taking down these Jill dudes. Either way, we're going to get Ice Beam here pretty soon. We just need to beat two more gym leaders. <laughs> and then we can get, uh, what do you call it? Alright, so we register him in the Pokénav. And then we get a uh, Surf. I think Lombre should be able to learn that, right? And then, uh, the hardest thing we're going to do is uh, worry about evolving this thing. Definitely naming your Charizard Charlie now. Dude, that's funny. Charla and Charlie. Put them both in the, uh... Put them both in the, uh... Daycare. And whatever egg they spawn, it could be like Charlotte and something else. There's a lot of names that start with CH. Alright, so we got a coughing here. So this is the one we gotta catch. Just gonna go for a fake out here. Go to Rakishi. Probably another fake out. Should do the trick. Hopefully it doesn't knock it out. Okay, perfect. We got him right in the red pocket. And we're going to go ahead and throw this Pokeball here. And we're running out of balls too. So we got to make sure we go stock up on some of those. But for now, I think we only have uh, two more encounters to deal with. So coughing was caught. Yeah, I almost clicked Rock Smash. All right, what are we naming coughing? Uh, let's see. I have no nickname for this thing, honestly. I normally nickname it just something toxic related. Swamp. 
smoke a lot. I'm gonna nickname it Fart. I'm being creative. It has little toots coming out of all its holes. So I'm gonna nickname it Fart. Fart ass? <laughs> I should have added that. Fart ass. Also, guys, if the music is too loud, Compared to my voice, let me know how I'll fix that for you guys. But Numal is fine. Eh, we're not going to worry about that. We're just going to get the hell out of here. Alright, perfect. Man, Torko would have been cool. It's a rare encounter in here too. Alright, we got some raspberries. How fitting. And now I gotta find out if uh, the bottom route is connected to this route. So let me just get these berries and I'll look at that here. And also, I have Streamlabs uh, doing that for me now. I didn't want to, I don't like to talk about it because it sounds like I'm begging for money and such. But if y'all wanna go ahead and read about it it's uh basically just reminding everyone uh to subscribe and follow to help me make great content for you guys and um subs uh subs get special perks like emotes and badges that i'm getting made uh hopefully by the end of this weekend and uh that'll be added to y'all stuff whenever y'all are watching along in the stream i caught hot pokemon in the fiery path take a look Oh, aren't you an adorable trainer? Please, I need a romantic battle. And I'm somewhat decent. Decent in what? In bed? In battle? In cooking? What? You know she's a virgin. Alright, Numel and Shroomer should coming out here. So we got Natsu and Table. Uh, it would be a good move here if we actually had something to hit Numel with. But we don't. But we can take out that Shroomish with an Ember. Alright, we'll get some decent damage off on Numel there with the Fake Out. And Shroomish hangs on by one. And goes for the Leech Seed on Natsu. Also guys, don't forget to use your Z-Bucks in the chat. You can unlock certain things like highlighting your comments and whatnot. Alright, I'm going to go to win here. Wait, no, that's a terrible idea. I'm going to go to Rakishi here. Numel's ground. I didn't think about that. But um, Shroom is going to go down here. And uh, Numel's just going to sit there looking dumb. And also, guys, at 100 followers, we will be doing a giveaway on uh, the More Gaming's Facebook group. So if y'all get, um, if y'all help me get to 100 followers, I will be hosting the giveaway here and there. So everyone will get uh, a chance to win something. I was thinking about doing some plushie giveaways. Like buy five and then raffle. Everyone who enters in the top five people get, get a plushie that I have. Oh, Roselia gets burned, so burn should take it down here. Oh, no, Mega Drain's going to do the work. And I know if I would have uh, waited to evolve Lotad, it would have got... Um, what do you call it? It would have it would have gotten a better thing. It, it would have got Giga Drain as well. But at the time, I just didn't think about it. So it was like, oh, well, too late. Rakishi goes rock too, man. Does it take down the Slugma? It does. So we finally take out that team, no problem. 
Now let's go ahead and use our Pokenav and see if the map uh, falls along the same route. Yeah, so it's just Route 112. So that's our Mel Meryl encounter. 111, we can't get our encounter yet. We don't have the Go Goggles. Show me how much you've toughened your Pokemon. Dude, I've never battled you before. How would you gauge if I'm better now than I was before? You make no sense. Alright, anyways. Go table! We're going to go ahead and go for the fake out here. And we're actually neutral to electric type attack, so I'm just going to go for the fury swipes. Ooh, critical hit on the first one. Beautiful. Takes down that electric... Critical hit on both turns. Fucking Lombre ain't messing around. He's pissed he doesn't have a grass or water type attack move. He's like, I'm going to take out Pokemon either way. All right. But now a water type is in, so we can go to win the mining. A lot of alliteration there with in, win, in, mining. I should have named it winning. Because uh, that's just replacing the W, the M with the W. But we're going to go ahead and go for Spark here. And Walmart goes down, no problem. Alright guys, on the next route, I am definitely trying to get me a, uh, a Skarmory. That'd be, that'd feel a great gap on my team. Oh, but fucking Spindas are everywhere. Should we make a clause where Spindas don't count? <laughs> nah, I guess, I guess I can't do that, right? Watch, we, we'll get, we won't get a Spinda, but we'll get a Numal. Alright, so... He is the guy who gives us the TM-43 Secret Power. Which helps us get secret bases and stuff. So it's like, oh cool, my favorite number helps us get bases. Awesome. But we're not going to worry about getting bases right now. Let's just go ahead and worry about healing up. Heal up our Pokemon. Yeah, 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 yeah. And also, guys, we will be streaming for a while tonight. So sit back, relax, kick, you, kick your feet up, get you some popcorn. Um, probably going to start a... Uh, oh, what do you call it? A cage lock with the one and only uh, David. GS Kamikaze, I should say. I'm pretty sure there's a lot of Davids in the world. But you know what I mean. So Machop is going to go ahead and come out here. Fake out and Fury Swipes is all we can do. And that Machop is tanky. It took that pretty well. Oh great, we miss. Let's, let's see what Nature Power is up here. Alright, so when you're on a cave, you can use Nature Power. It goes into Rock Slide. And let's go ahead and get these Fury Swipes going off here. Get a crit. All five. We need all five. He's focused up. No! We needed all five. Now he's going to get a crit. Okay, he did it. All right. Two should take it out here. And down goes the Machop. No problem. All right. And that's the only one he had. So we can go ahead and move on and see what else there is here. And nothing. We moved on to see nothing. Let's go ahead and go back. I guess it's just showing you there's more spots for bases. Alright, let's go ahead and grab these berries. Oh, your Pokemon look interesting. Look like interesting actors. I have to ask for an engagement. What the heck are you talking about? I 
I don't know if that's me or what, but I hear it vibrating somewhere. Maybe it's just part of the song. Oh, uh, yeah, I think it is. <laughs> I thought I was going crazy. I was like, my phone is not getting any messages. What's going on? Nature power turned into swift. And down goes the wingle. Oh, critical hit. Beautiful. All right, we got a Roselia coming in. We're going to go ahead and go to Natsu here. And I'm not trying to speed up today. I just want I just don't want to speed up through the battles. I want y'all to enjoy the slug fest that's going to happen around here. I'm going to start trying to talk more about the Pokémon as well so we can really enjoy the the region. All right, Rakishi. Rakishi comes in, goes ahead and gets a fake out off. Numa flinched. So we're going to go ahead and just get the Rock Tomb off. Hell yeah. Alright guys. And quickly, we're, I'm going to go over this real quick. Just in case y'all decide to stick around. Um, later on tonight, I think about 8pm Central Time. I'm going to switch over to Pokemon Sword and Shield. And get ready to do a a cage lock with our friend David, GS Kamikaze. So basically, I'm going to go over the rules real quick. Oh, we got a Slugma. So that's going to be our first encounter here. And that's the one we got to catch. But um, a cage lock is basically what we were doing. It's a Nuzlocke. But um, the special rule is... Sorry, hold on. The special rule is after each gym, we will be putting a Pokemon into the into a battle. So it's a 1v1 battle. And we're going to nickname this thing Lava Come. I don't know why. I just feel like I just feel like naming it that. Call me Lowbrow or whatever, but I'm doing it. Can't stop me. Can't stop on stop. Lava come. But yeah, the it's a, basically a 1v1 death match to the death to see who comes out on top. Uh winner will get a perk, uh, such as held item or TM usage. And uh the loser will lose their Pokemon as if they died in game. So there's strategy as well to it. You can throw in your best Pokemon and get it a perk, or you can throw in your worst Pokemon and just um, make it make it till you fake it. But you do have to use a Pokemon in your party. So, oh, Earthquake. Interesting. I think it's resisted, though. No, it's not. I don't know why I always think Trapinch is a bug type. Tell me why they didn't give Flygon the bug typing. Bug Dragon? That'd be dope, honestly. Thanks for finding me, We, we but we still have to battle. Were you able to get in the middle of all the gas? Whatever he said. <clears throat> Alright, Ninja Boy Lung. And Camper Lawrence wants to battle. So we see our first ball toy. And and we see another coughing here. So what we're going to do here is we're going to double into the coughing. Because I don't want it to self-destruct. And uh, ball toy is probably going to self-destruct now. <laughs> uh, I think he gets it. I don't know. But Ninjask is in. All right, so he mud slapped the non super effective one, which is cool. I'm cool with that. He probably assumed we were gonna switch. 
Oh, no, 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 don't do that. Earthquake. Uh, yeah, that would have been bad. Let's go ahead and Fury Swipes there and go for the Ember on Ninjask. I almost clicked that move without even thinking Natsu would have been dead. Oh, Ninjask goes down. Paper thin defense. So he goes for the side beam instead of the super effective uh, mutt ground type move. So we're going to go ahead and try to take this thing down. And Table misses a Fury Swipes again this battle. Mud Slap does go off here. And now we're going to switch. Let's go ahead and go to speed. Resistant to ground type moves. And Table is going to rip him a new one. Hit three times. Thank you. The ball toy finally goes down, and then we had another battle coming right up. All right, so now we got a sand shrew here. Now we can go for nature's power and go for the wing attack as well. Wing attack probably do the job though. We are like, oh shit, we are eight levels above. I thought it'd be enough, but it doesn't. Table goes for the earthquake on sand shrew, and sand shrew is gonna go down. You know what? They should, um, based on the arena you're in, in Gen 8, they should uh, make Nature Power do that typing. That would make the most sense to me. Does it already do that? I don't know. But if it doesn't, it fucking should. Damn, straight into another battle. You, you want to battle with me? Even though I just caught my Pokemon? Uh, dude, I don't want to. You, you came up to me. Uh-oh, we got a furry. Pokemaniac Wyatt would like to battle. Sent out an Aeron. Well, Aeron, I'm so sorry for you because I got nature's power. And I'm going to go ahead and Earthquake you into the second dimension. You're going to be the first Aeron to see an Ultra Beast because you're gone. Destroyed. Alright, next. Oh, another Aeron. Let's go ahead and go to Win. He's our lowest level. Well, aside from Rakishi. But Rocky, she got the power not to need the levels right now. Alright, we're going to go ahead and spark one up. Not 420 yet, but soon to be. And Aaron goes down as well. And Pokemaniac, I don't know how he caught two Aarons over here, but whatever. All right, let's go ahead and get that nugget. So if you check these little mounds here, uh, you can possibly get some items. I always check. Uh, I normally remember exactly where to look, but you never know. You might miss one. Good thing we didn't catch that trash-ass Pokemon. All right, here we go. Another battle. Also, guys, let me know if you're enjoying actually watching these random battles or if you'd rather me skip through them like I was doing. All up to you guys. I want to make y'all enjoy it, really. If y'all prefer skipping these random battles and only doing the important ones, let me know. Or if you like seeing all the battles and me commentating them, that works too. Either way, this game isn't really a long one. We've just been taking a long time to do it because of all the uh, the save errors and whatnot. But I figured out a way to uh, bypass all that. Um, so basically, since I'm doing it on an emulator, I can uh, I can save on the emulator as well as in the game. So I'm gonna save in the game and on the emulator. So even if uh, I get to a point where, for some reason, my t my game didn't save, uh, it saved on the emulator and I could advance to where I was. So it won't be such a big deal anymore.
So I don't know if I've asked you guys yet, but what is y'all's uh what is y'all's favorite third gen Pokemon? For me, it would be uh for me it would be Agron. Love that thing. I love the way the Mon looks. Obviously Metagross is the better still type option if you're gonna pick one. But uh I don't know. Just something about Agron. He just looks so fucking dope. And the first time I played through it, I that was one of the first Pokemon in Emerald or whichever version of the game I was playing. Because honestly, I had all of them. Um, that's the first Pokemon in this game that I got to level 100. Because it's just like, why wouldn't I want to use this thing? It's so fucking awesome. Alright, Justin, you went ahead and went with Zigzagoon. That's a fairly good Pokemon, especially in the Hoenn region. Um, I always like to name mine Ziggy. And then uh, I make jokes about it. <laughs> I'm like, look, it's Ziggy Azalea. And, uh, yeah, it's just, I enjoy it. From out of the ashes, I leap. Hiya! I challenge thee. And also, I also I always like the Pokemon that can learn Flamethrower, Thunderbolt, Surf. I don't know what it is, but when, when you have that kind of coverage, it's like, of course that Mon's going to be useful as shit. So it's just like, yeah, I, I like this Mon. I'm going to go with it all the time. All right, so that coughing's here. We're going to switch out to Min or Win. And uh, spark it up. Just don't explode on me. Uh, which Pokemon do you not know? Agron? Coughing goes down. Oh yeah, Ag Ag Agron is one that can do it. Rhydon can do it as well. Uh, Flamethrower, I think it can learn. No, I don't think it can learn. Flamethrower. But Agron can learn it. Agron can learn Ice Beam, Thunderbolt, Flamethrower, Earthquake, and all that stuff. Same as Nidoking. And then they got kind of the same build as well. Like, you know, big bulky dinosaur looking Pokemon. But those are my favorite types, like Pokemon that can have all sorts of coverage. And Table is getting a lot of screen time here. So once it gets to level 28, I'm going to go ahead and swap out. Let someone else get some glory. Uh, do we not battle this guy? No, he's not a battler, I guess. Already got that item there. Alright, here we go. Yeah, Aggron's an amazing Pokemon in my eyes. And then when he got the Mega, I was like, oh, <laughs> that's War Machine right there. It, it made it even better. And then, um,. But Zigzagoon going into Linoon in that amazing Belly Drum Extreme Speed set, it's just awesome. I can never pull it off for some reason. But, you know, for those who can, good on you. <laughs> Alright. Oh, can we get the burn? Can we get the burn? No, we can't. Sand Attack goes straight into Natsu there. Meryl flinches though. I'm going to go nature power and switch out Natsu to speed. Because speed is also around that level. Dude, I really like the way Mega Celix came out. Mega Celix is a wonderful mon. 
I like the way it looks. I just wish they would have gave it a little more something. I don't know what it is. <sighs> um, Special-wise, it was still pretty frail. Uh, Speed-wise, didn't help it any. I mean, they boosted his defense even more and gave it way more attack. But, I mean, that was just so much that Mon had. Slowbro as well, yeah. Slowbro can learn all those moves too. It's just versatile Pokemon like that are awesome. I just enjoy them. And then, uh... My, you don't know your favorite Mega off the top of your head? I know my... Oh, look at this! It wasn't planned out at all. Look at this. Lombre and Swellow versus Lombre and Swellow. How fitting. That's how you know we got some power on our team. But uh, if I had to pick my favorite, uh, it would probably... I'm going to switch Lotad out before it dies. I'm going to go to Min. But if I had to pick my favorite uh, Mega, obviously it'd be Charizard. It, Mega X is my favorite aesthetically. And Mega Y is also... I mean, it's equally one of my favorites. But if I had to pick one, it'd be Mega X for sure. I like the physical Pokemon. Mega Ampharos is a good one too. It's really bulky and it hits like a fucking truck. All right, his swallow goes for the quick attack there. And it's not going to be able to take two attacks from us, so down it goes. And so far, our team is looking cool. I love swallow too. That, that one, ugh. flame orb guts ability. Yes, please. Take that all day. Slowbro's Mega was derpy, but it was bulky. You damn right about that. It's won me a, it's won me a Pokey Dippies episode, so I'll take it any day of the week. Slowbro is just a defensive take in general, and any Pokemon that gets Iron Defense plus uh, Slack Off, it's a Pokemon that you want on your team. Yeah, Swellow is really fast. It was one of my hardest. It was one of my hardest hitting Pokemon on my normal team. On my normal gym team. Sadly, it still has not made a comeback yet. Okay, so let's go ahead and get about 10 great balls. Four potions. And we should be good every other way. Every other place. So let's go ahead and see. Uh, after I'm done with the game, I might go. I might do a um, battle tent run, battle tent stream of all the battle tents. Oh no, they need to stop with Mega Mega Snorlax would be disgusting. Add on to its uh, physical defense as well as special defense. That'd be gross. Why would you put that in Game Freak's mind, Justin? <laughs> That's horrible. It's okay, though. Uh, table takes out the bar boat pretty quick, and I, I was supposed to switch this thing out, honestly. You go ahead and take a seat. He has Miracle Seed and no Grass-type move. Hilarious. Uh, uh, give me that. Uh, doesn't he give me a... Uh... Oh, I thought he gave me a dig. It's this kid in here. Yeah, G-Max Snorlax is redonkulous. Just buried up every turn. It's like... Did you have to break that mon? Like, that much? And then with Trick Room, Belly Drum, uh, the Citrus Berry thing, he never died. And he was plus six attack and the fastest thing on the screen. 
it's like, oh gosh, you didn't have to do that to us, but you did, and we hate you for it. I do like Snorlax Z Crystal though. It gets up and goes, gets like a super fast animation. Something you wouldn't expect from it. And then in the sh in the show, he's a baseball player, so he, he has to use uh the something pancake, and he runs around all the bases really fast. All right, wing attack should take out the barboach, and Ember should take out Nuzleaf. It does hit like a tank, no matter which way you slice it. I mean, the only thing you're investing in a slow, uh, uh, the only thing you're investing into a Snorlax is its attack and its special defense. I mean, you could make it physically defensive, but it's not, you know, not the best idea. Energy powder. All right, my team's looking good. We already talked to the lady by the computer. And we got a few magic cards to get rid of. Oh, he switched it up. Magic Harp to Goldeen. Goldeen, 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 Goldeen. All right, Barboach. I don't know how that thing sounds. Magic Harp, Magic Harp. Barboach goes down. I used it in the normal steel team and it was okay. <laughs> no, nah, we don't need Endeavor. We don't want our Pokemon being that low on level. I mean, that low on health. Oh, I was trying to switch it out. All right, Lombard's coming in. Let's go ahead and get Rakishi out there. Fake out time, just to get that added damage to make sure we Oko. Oh, they got almost oko it by itself. You could swift me all you want, but you ain't gonna take these hands. Rokiji! Here we go. All right. We got a revive there. Can't use it, but we got it. Just bring it around town. Get us some person berries. A person berries. Oh, no. No item there. Surprising. That looks like a space where a uh, hidden item would be. Oh, and she gave us a low tad doll. How cute. We have a low tad on our team. Might as well. He just gave us a berry. All right. Let's go ahead and make sure we don't have speed up front because we do. Let's go ahead and get some uh, levels up on our other Pokemon. Who taught you about Pokemon? Your mom. That's who. Yo, mama. Alright, Senior and Junior, Tyra and Ivy. So they're about to graduate high school. Hello, ladies. Um, we're going to go ahead and fake out the Graveler because we ain't trying to mess around with that mess. And we're going to go ahead and... <laughs> and we're going to go ahead and take out this Roselia here. Oh, no, we didn't. Joe Mama did. Yeah, that one works too. Oh, uh, shit. Well, we did get paired...
Okay, um, let's go ahead and go for an arm thrust. Hopefully that takes it out. And let's go ahead and get a berry. You know what? Let's just, um, yeah, let's get a berry on this thing. Use a chetty, Betty. On not to. Arm thrust, take this thing down. Don't let this thing self-destruct on me. Wow, you would, you would do this. Okay, and it ro rolls out instead. We can we can deal with that. Critical hit rollout. Not also. Shit. Arm thrust and ember. There we go. Not too. Finally takes it down with the ember, and we're good to go from there. And now we're about to get to the juicy part, guys. We got some story coming up. Camping's fun. You can fish, roast marshmallows, and tell spooky stories. But the best of all are Pokemon battles. It's not nighttime. How are you camping? All right, well, Sandshrew comes in to battle, and we're just going to go for the arm thrust because I misclick. And, of course, we only hit two times, so we're going to take a Poison Sting here. And, honestly, not too bad, because I believe we're our guts boosted. Sand Attack does come off, though, so that's a little bit annoying. I know you can camp in the day, but it makes more sense to camp at night. Alright, Nuzleaf is going to come in. Let's go ahead and get Natu out there. Ember attack. I forgot how big of a gap there are between the, the, the third gym and the fourth gym. But then the fourth and fifth gym are like right at the same time really. So it's like, ugh, I ain't got no time to battle. Alright, Carbos, we get that. Um, let's go ahead and patch a berry. Use it, don't check it. Now let's go ahead and give secret power to somebody. I'm going to give secret power to speed. Only because it needs a good uh, normal type move. And let's see who we could give dig to. And we could give it to Natsu. But it probably makes more sense on Rakishi. Uh, let's see what Natsu has. Grout. Only Ember really to attack. Stop trying to teach you. Yes. Then let's look at Rakishi here. And his moveset's full. So I'm going to go ahead and give it to uh, Natsu instead. Give it another attacking move. Sell those for money. Let's go ahead and potion up as well. All right, Lombard. Oh, we didn't catch our Pokemon here yet, so we still got to do that. Oh, fo, fo, fo. you want to battle my Pokemon? Yes, I do. Oh, dude, you should uh, call it back and quit. No? All right. Boom, dead. I'm surprised it took two hits. Must have a modest Rakishi. All right, and we get a Swablu here. Uh, hopefully, Fake Out doesn't take it out. And it doesn't. Beautiful. And now let's go ahead and throw a great ball at it. And let's get some nicknames for the Swablu. That means you, Eddie. Alright, Swablu was cut. Let's go ahead and see if y'all can come up with some decent nicknames there. My body hurts. Blue. Um. Uh, I'm gonna go with candy. Cause it looks like cotton candy, right? Am I the only one who thinks that its wings look like cotton candy? And then it's a girl. And then if we name it Candy, we can sing the song. I want candy. And then <laughs> it does. 
All right, so we got a carbos and a protein, and this is weird. I don't know why they put this here. There's nothing to do there. All right, so let's go ahead and look at our items here. I know it won't help much, but let's go ahead and give the protein to Rakishi and the carbos to speed. Battle me, you fool. I don't want to fake out that thing because it has flame body, most likely. I want sanity, but I can't get it because I'm off my meds. All right, 300 EXP, and now Wingle's going to come in here. And then another Rock Tomb. Why not? Oh, and it misses. Of course. Right when you rely on a Pokemon not to... This is what we were talking about last time, right? The Rock Move thing. Rock Moves are just so unreliable. Rock Tomb. Go suck a dick. Alright. Well, anyway. Is this an item thing? No. All right, now we got ourselves a double battle again. Yeah, I'm going to change that timer thing too. It's for every 20 minutes, but I'm going to switch it to every every 30 minutes instead. It's been popping up more than you know, more than it should. I don't want to sound needy. <laughs> Cloud bye. All right, all that should be good to go there. All right, now we won't see that big ass message so much. Cause I mean, I stream for three hours, so seeing it, what, five times is enough? All right, we're gonna go ahead and go for the fake out. Mm, yeah, Just, you know what, let's go for the arm thrust here. And go for the ember there. Ooh, critical hit. Almost took out the lombre. Nature power turns to the rock slide. Oh, no. That could be bad. For not to, anyway. Oh, it did nothing. We are 10 levels above. I do got to sit not to down now, too. Holy shit. I didn't even realize how high of a level it was getting. Charizard just gonna run away with it. Numo comes in now. And we're gonna go ahead and go for a rock tomb there. Ember again on the Lombre. Lombre goes down. Lombre's going down, 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 down. Next is Numo. Next is Numo. All right, and then Meryl comes in as well. Oh, critical hit will take that thing down, no problem. I guess uh, Rock Tomb wanted to redeem itself. Alright, now we get an arm thrust here, and I'm going to go for... I'm going to switch out to win. Oh, he gets his defenses up. So it might help against Rakishi here, but it's certainly not going to help against win. Dang, Rakishi was like, you know what? handle my lightweight and when was like you got it dude spark it sparky spark all right so we finally defeat those two and we can move on one more battle and then we will have uh we'll have some story to go along with us you're you're supposed to your leehoo since it doesn't echo here. Then why are you doing it, you dummy? You want to hear echo? Your leehoo. If you didn't hear echo, I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> 
You're supposed to. Um, arm thrust here. Two hit KO on the Geo dude. Geo dude. Geo dude. Hoodie, Hoodyama. All right, so Geo dude goes down to Hoodyama, and then macho, macho. No, it's like uh, his is a little more high pitched, right? It's just like macho. I don't know. I don't know how to do a macho voice. I guess. You're good, Justin. I understand. Can't be uh, interactive the whole time. But uh, as long as you're watching and showing me some support, I appreciate that. Even if I was just in the background, that's cool too. Any support counts. Alright. Our first encounter in Meteor Falls, of course, is a freaking Zubat. Oh, and... <laughs> Fake out took that thing out. Did not mean for that to happen, but you know, not mad about it. It's not gonna be the last time we see a Zubat. <laughs> With this meteor, right? That thing in the Mount Chimney will. Oh, hey? I don't know who you are, but if you get in the way of Team Magma, don't expect any mercy. Hold it right there, Team Magma. You're badly mistaken if you think you can have your way with the world. Aw, oh, shit. <laughs> Even Team Aqua joins us. But it's too much trouble to deal with you all. Yeah, it, it doesn't matter. We've got the meteorite, so off to Mount Chimney we go. <laughs> Be seeing you, you Team Aqua dingbats. Oh shit, he called them dingbats. Didn't I see you before at Slateport's museum? Ah, so your name is Joe. At the time, I thought you were one of Team Magma's goons. Hmm, you're an odd kid. Team Magma is a dangerous group of total fanatics. They engage in destruction, claiming to expand the landmass. They are the rivals to us. The sea-loving Team Aqua are... Boss, we should give chase to Team Magma. Yes, yes, we must. We've got to hurry. Here, there's no telling what Team Magma will do at Mount Chimney. Joe, you should keep an eye out for Team Magma too. Farewell. Yeah, dingbats, it's really a kid's game. I would have said, like, dumbasses. I'm sure that's what he meant. I'm, I'm Cosmo, a professor. Team Magma asked me to guide them to Meteor Falls. But they tricked me. They even took my meteor right away. And then another similar bunch, Team Aqua, showed up after that. I don't understand any of it, but that's Team Magma. <laughs> like if it was a sitcom. What are they going to do with the meteorite at Mount Chimney? I don't know, why don't you go fucking la get your fucking lazy ass up and go check. Ugh. Men. What pigs. Got away safely. Alright, yeah. It's... We can't catch anything now. We got a moonstone though. Ooh, soul rock. That's a psychic type. I'm not gonna mess with that. Whee! Dang lazy bumps. Nope, no item there. Oh. Some more places where you can Oh god, here we go. My strongest skill is busting bricks with my forehead. Dude, you're gonna get a concussion. Stop. So we got a Machop here. But I was saying uh, those are more uh, hidden base spaces that you can use. Machop. Gets faked out there, and two arm thrusts will do the job. And if anyone's wondering, I am gonna make a base. All right, Justin. Yeah, I'll be I'll be around for a while. Like I said, uh, at eight o'clock, we're gonna switch over to uh, Sword and Shield and do some of that. So I'll be seeing you, man. Thanks for dropping in. Uh, Rakishi, you impressed me. Give me a rematch after I redo my training. Okay. 
But uh, yeah, guys, I will be making a base. So it's going to be exciting. This beach is my secret training spot. Don't come butting in. Okay, well then, let me leave. Fake out time. Here we go. Ooh. Dead. All right, we're going to bulk up here. Oh, no, he goes for confusion. I thought he was going to detect. It's okay. Confusion didn't do much, so. We should be fine. Arm thrust time. Ooh, it's attack real sharply. Alright. We took that thing down, no problem. Makuhita. We must fight our son. It's so cute. It looks like the little dumpling thing from uh, the Disney the Disney short. He's like the little dumpling kid. Who's a dick, by the way. Jesus Christ. Mom was just trying to be nice and shit. And he just a little ungrateful little bastard. I haven't trained enough. Oh, you haven't. Okay, fine. You're free to come here. In return, I'd like to battle you again. Okay, so we're just we're just adding people to the party now. All right, so we need to get Wen up to, to snuff with everyone else. You would think there was an item there, but I guess not. All right, and the cool thing is about this game. If you give a Pokemon an EXP share, and it's a double battle, they will get more of the EXP. Alright, so here we go. We're going to spark into Metatite, and we're going to... We're just going to arm thrust into Zangoose, because that thing's scary. Okay, so the tech comes out. I mean, it's not bad. So we don't hit Metatite, but Arm Thrust do go off into Zangoose here. And Zangoose is one of my favorite Pokemon in this game as well. It just never got to really use it because you catch it so late in the game. Well, not late, late, but even then, it's rare because you only get it in one game. So it's just like, oh, choices. All right, we're going to go ahead and rock tomb. We're going to double into the Surviper. Baby, I'm wrapped around your pretty little finger again. Oh, I don't like when that happens. We missed our attack, and now Surviper is just going to sit there and be annoying. Ooh, critical hit. That makes up for it. But Spoink comes in. One of the most underrated Pokemon, I must say. Spoink is just a dope design. Especially the evolution form. Alright, so Spoink goes down. It's just crazy the fact that if it stops bouncing, it dies. It's like, whoa, whoa, dude, relax. I can't live without bouncing. Alright, so we do get our health back up. And we take down Survivor with the spark. And we're good to go. PP up for us, gang gang. Go ahead and heal up real quick. Then we'll come back around this way. 
Baby, I'm wrapped around your pretty little finger again. Listen to Wrapped by George Strait. And that's where I'm getting the song from. Drop your SoundCloud, brother. Broski? Broham? Bro, bro? Alright. Um, let's go ahead and keep coming this way. Like ACDC, we're going to walk this way. We're going to talk this way. Everything this way. And let's go ahead and take on Team Magma. Team Magma's going to go down. Team Magma's going down, 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 down. Really hard. Maybe. Oh, his Poochie and a Beast. Look at that. Three versus one. All right, well, here we go. Another double battle. Then uh, fake out into Numa. Almost takes it out, too. So, Wynn's going to take down the Zubat. Gets to level 27. Rakishi gets that little 57. Oh, can't do that. Ground type. Don't forget. Quick attack does take it out, though, with a critical hit. <laughs> so you've come all this way here. But you're too late. I've already delivered the meteorite from Meteor Falls to the boss. Now he's going to battle us. Magma Admin Tabitha. Alright, so this is not where we want to be. Let's go ahead and get speed out here. Goes for a growl, which is fine. We're going to go ahead and wing attack here. Ember comes off. Burn us. We got guts. So wing attack goes off and knocks out the Numel. Another Numel's coming at us. And funny enough, Tabitha's a boy, so... We're just going to sweep these numerals with wing attack. Well, you know what? Uh, Poochianas we can deal with. So let's get Wynn back out here. Spark it up. Alright, here we go. That Poochiana goes down, no problem. And then Zubat's here. Gotta take care of that threat. <laughs> As if it were a threat. I don't know why they made Tabitha fat in the new games. It doesn't make no sense. The power contained in the meteorite. By amplifying its power with this machine, Mount Chimney's volcanic activity will in instantly intensify. Its energy will grow deep inside the crater and <laughs> hmm, who are you? I'd hear Archie bemoaning a child who's been meddling in Team Aqua's affairs. It must be you he meant. Hmm. So, you're thinking of insuffering, uh, insuffering, interfering with us, Team Magma? Now you listen. Long ago, living things used the land to live and grow. That is why land is all important. 
it is a cradle of all. That is why Team Magma is dedicated to expansion of the landmass. It is for further advancements of humankind and Pokemon alike. And for that, we need the power of what sleeps within this mountain. Oh, there was no need for you to learn that much. But no matter, I'll teach you the consequences of meddling in our grand desire. Dude, get a breath mint. Magma leader Maxi would like to battle. Mighty Anna comes in. And all we do is win, 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 no matter what. We did get intimidated, but that don't really matter because we special attackers. Boom! Spark is going <laughs> to... I was going to say I was going to knock it out, but I guess not. Spark is going to do a three-hit KO, though. Two bites ain't going to be enough, and we're going to go ahead and get a quick attack off, but... Super Potion is going to go ahead and heal up that Mighty Yenna very well. Quick attack probably wouldn't have taken out anyway. But we do get another spark off, and we get our spark to finish it off. Mighty Anna finally goes down. Next up, we have the very common Zubat, and also a spark will take that thing down. Ooh, camera up. Finally some uh, offensive power. But we're going to bring out Rakishi here to deal with that thing. Alright, fake out time. Camera up flinches. And now we go for the... Ooh, Ember. Now we go for the arm thrust. Ooh, and that's gonna need five you got it you got it in you damn right rakishi gets a critical hit on the last one and takes down the camera up what a clutch performance from the big man and win grew to level 28 trying to learn charm let's see if it needs it i would say no so i'm not gonna teach it that I was caught off guard. Okay. Enough of this back talk. But don't think that this is the last you've seen of Team Magma. Fool, fool, fool. Even without the meteorite, if we obtain the orb. Fool, 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 fool. Okay, what orb? What orb? Tell me! Alright. Joe, thank you. With your help, we thwarted Team Magma's destructive plan. But you, whose side are you on? Ah, it doesn't matter. We will remain vigilant and keep up our pursuit of Team Magma. So, we shall meet again. Alright. Well, I'm going to take this meteorite since no one took it. Or wanted it. And it's mine now. So... If anyone comes looking for it, you can tell them to go fuck themselves. Because it's mine. I said it's mine! All right, we're going to buy a couple of lava cookies, too, because uh, basically full hills for a lot cheaper. All right. So one time I had this dog and then. Yeah, it went wolf wolf. And that was the story about my dog as I bought the lava cookies. All right, time to go. We do not want win uh, there. So we're going to go ahead and put. uh. Rakishi there. Geo dude comes out and we go ahead and go for a few arm thrusts. Geo dude goes down. Voltoy comes out. Oh, and it goes for Rock Tomb and outspeeds us.
Ooh, we get five hits off, but still not enough. The ball toy is resisted. Mud slap goes off, and now our accuracy is shot. And, of course, we miss with one accuracy drop. With our speed and accuracy dropping, Rakishi could be in a tough spot here. Oh, but he finally lands the arm thrust, and down goes Ball Toy. Now let's go ahead and see what wild Pokemon are lurking for us. Let's go ahead and put Table instead of Rakishi. Rakishi kind of hits a little hard. And it's a Numo. So we're going to go ahead and give it a nice little rock smash as well. All right, and now it looks like in prime position to get caught with a great ball. So now we have another fire, and now we have a ground type. All right, Numa was caught. We're going to go ahead and name it. Um... Oh, yeah, I have a, I have a nickname for it. Wednesday. Does anyone else do that? Do y'all spell out? Do y'all talk out Wednesday when you spell it like Widness Day? I, I learned that in second grade and I've done it ever since. And that's a hard word to learn how to spell. And if you don't think so, then you got the blood of a demon in you. All right, so we got a Poochiana here. We're going to go ahead and go for the Fury Swipe. I should have went for the Fake Out first turn, but I'm stupid and I didn't. All right, I'm kind of done with these battles. Uh, swap to speed here. All right, there we go. We battled enough magma grunts to know what the hell he had. All right, time to go to Natsu here because we got some picnickers coming up. And we're going to go ahead and ember through. Ember. You're not missing anything, I promise you. Oh, we're asleep now. All right, cool. We defeated them, no problem. We could go back up to get items, but we don't have the acro bike right now. So we're just going to have to get what we can and deal with that later. So let's go ahead and go for the Ember and Spark. Then Ember and Spark again. Okay, nothing there. Then the last guy of the route. And we take down his Pokemon, no problem. Everything is just so wonderful. And if you think we're using that new mold, we are not. We got Charizard. Well, we will have a Charizard, but we got Charmander for now. And we don't need that. We don't need that, but what we do need is the, a water type move on our grass water type Pokemon. Let me go ahead and look that up, see what time uh, he gets that move. <laughs> he doesn't learn shit. He learns water sport at level 31, but that ain't gonna help you none. Um let's see. Where can we get this? Oh, Lord, help me. We don't got a water type. Oh, well, thankfully, we at least have a rock type move on uh, Rakishi.
Okay, so I mean that's not gonna be able to do much with that. Sorry, I'm getting rid of some notifications here. I don't like to have them. Alright, let's go ahead and continue on. So basically, we'll get Rakishi up some levels so we can be ready for the uh, gym. Let's see. Excuse me. Shit, wrong one. All right, so level 29 is her ace, and then Norman's is level 31. So basically, Rocky, she's going to be uh, running through both their teams. All right, so this is a tricky gem right here. So let's go ahead and bring Rakishi over so he can get to level 29. We're going to rock. Tomb, you know what? Fake out and spark. All right, so now we rock tomb, spark. We need to get the EXP share off of uh, what's his name? Take that off. You're already level 29. Switch you out with the uh, table is not going to be used in this gym at all. So. Move him down. All right, so we got arm thrust on Kecleon. And I'm going to go, no, not dig. You know what? This is a bad idea. Let's go ahead and go to speed. Ooh, due to the color change, it's no longer a normal type and goes to fire type. Let's go ahead and rock tomb that thing. No, you know what? Let's do this. Let's go ahead and arm thrust that thing and wing attack Kecleon. We might just get over leveled in these few battles. But uh, it is what it is. It is what it is. Nah, I mean. Rock tomb, rock tomb. Sorry guys, I'm getting a little impatient. I want to get to this gym battle. We're over an hour and a half in, and we haven't. All we've done is a. Uh, all we've done is a uh, other battles. We did a little bit of story though. That's good. Ooh, knockoff. Give me that. Um, shit, rock tomb though. You have knockoff isn't strong in this game, so I'm just gonna not use it. Yeah, stop learning. Fine. But we are at level 29, so let's go ahead and move a uh, speed over. Ooh, Meditite, wing attack, dead. All right, I think it's this way. Oh, no, it's not. Okay, so it's this way for sure. Then this way. Then this way. Then this way. Oh yeah! All right. Then we think it's this way. To the middle. Shit! Is it? Oh yeah! Oh no! Shit! All right. Well, that wasn't the right way. So you go down. Oh wait, no, it's not down. What am I doing? More slugmas. Guess it's to level twenty-nine. Well, that dude's got his bare feet on this rock, so that's not good. But it's okay. Shit. It's, uh... <laughs> I don't know where I'm going. All right, so you got to come this way. First. Then you come up. Then you come up. Then you come up again. <laughs> up again. Then you go all the way across. Then you go down. Then you jump down, and you're, I'm wrong. Okay, let's see. 
Um, okay, Let's do that. That's right. And then this is right. And then this is right. Correct, I mean. Uh, this is correct. So up, up. Let's go side here. Nope, that wasn't it. Okay, so it's up, up, up again, up again, shit, up again. <laughs> all right, so all the way to the right, all right, down. I just did that. No, that's wrong. Shit, I'm horrible at this. Okay, what's the one way we haven't gone? So this is that, the left. Well, that's the only way to go. That's the only way to go there. Go right here. That's the wrong way. You know what? Let's go up here. Okay. So that's up there. What the fuck? I don't know what I'm doing. I'm clearly lost. Please, sir. May you help me? I am terribly lost. Okay, so I went down that one. So it's this one. There we go. That's what I was doing wrong. Then this one shoots you up. Hey, we're at the gym. Let's go ahead and get some hype in the chat for that. Woo, woo. Let's go. There you go, Emerald Charizard. That's feeling the spirit. Now, let's see what we can do here. go ahead and make sure everyone's healed up as much as possible all right then we we'll drink some water and then we're good to go uh. welcome no wait puny trainer how good to see you've made it here. I've been entrusted with the... No, wait. Uh, I'm Flannery, and I'm the gym leader here. <laughs> Shit. Don't dare not underestimate me, though. I have been leader only short time. With skills inherited from my grandfather, I shall uh demonstrate the uh, hot moves we have honed in this land. Bit what? Oh, look at the knockers on her. Leader Flannery would like to battle. And she leads off with her Numo. Alright, so basically what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to bulk up. Like three, four times. And then just rock tomb everything. Rock tomb everything. Don't even give a fuck about magnitude. Cause it's not gonna do shit to our Pokemon. We're gonna sweep her. That's a promise. <gasps> Overheat! Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Alright, cool. So that's three bulk ups. We're gonna heal. And then uh, do three more. And... uh. Easiest gym we're gonna ever have until the next one because that's gonna be my game plan for that one, too. Might as well. The sunlight is strong with this one, all right? So let's go ahead and go for a rock, too. Oh, shit, I was supposed to do it again. So this is gonna take it out if it hits. Special attack keeps going down. And then the sun's out, too. I should have stalled out some sun turns. Oh, boy. This isn't good. Slugma's coming in. Alright, the sunlight is strong. I'm going to heal because she's probably going to go overheat. Oh, go smog. Okay. Woke up. Two more times and we're at... Plus six on attack and defense. Overheat. How much does this do? It's on a special side. 
We are especially tanky, but only so much. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Sunlight is strong, but it's going to fade away soon, hopefully. And we could take that overheat any day. So the sunlight finally faded, so it's probably going to get it up again. I'm going to heal up again. All right, sunny day is up. So I think it was two more bulk ups. And now we're going to stall out the rest of these turns. Sunny day wore off. Fuck, I mistimed it. Mm. I think we could live a hit from the incoming uh, Torkoal. So, hopefully. <laughs> hopefully. Here's to hoping. Oh, camera up. Fuck. I don't know if we can live a hit from that thing. The sunlight is strong. But so am I. Let's go for a rock tomb. Attract. Don't fall for it, Rakishi. Don't fall for it. You can be attracted to anything else except for that ugly ass camel toe right there in front of you. Don't do it. Don't, don't do it, you stupid. Mm. All right, overheat. That's gonna hurt. But it's not. It's not a special. It's not a special attacker. Okay. Whew. Special attack harshly fell, which is great for us. Don't. Don't. There you go. Crush it. Crush its dream. Break its heart. And its spirit. There we go. Camera up is gone. Oh, man. I don't know if we live a hit from that thing, though, either. <sighs> We're going to have to switch. Let's go not to here. We chose to bulk up in front of the only special gym in the game. How stupid are we? Sunlight faded, though. We're going to go ahead and go for the dig. We're going to dig a tunnel, dig, dig a tunnel, dig a tunnel, dig, dig a tunnel. Man, Torqua looks so badass. Look at that thing. It goes for sunny day. The sunlight got bright, but we resist the overheat. Go for dig. Ew, that thing goes for a track. Gross. Sunlight is still strong, but we get our dig off. And a track does finally come off now. Gross. It's like loving someone who smokes 12 packs a day. Like, stop. What are you doing? What are you thinking? What's on your mind, bro? Are you okay? Do you need help? Well, Natsu ain't falling for that shit. It goes for the ember. But it doesn't do enough. Damn! That, that hit us hard. That body slam was not playing around. We're going to go ahead and switch out to... Ugh. This is not good. Let's go to speed. Overheat comes off. Don't kill me. Don't kill... Don't kill speed! Don't kill speed! Oh, that hurts my heart. Oh, go fuck yourself. So, we lose speed. F's in the chat for that. Win, get your ass out here. You're killing this thing. You're destroying its face. Go for spark. Oh yeah, para. Damn, that's another lovable Pokemon we just lost. And fuck you for your Hyper Potion. I want to kick that bitch in the face. <sighs> well, we're, um, it's paired, so that's uh, a win in our book, I guess. 
I don't know. That's sad. That's depressing. Body slam comes off. It's gonna do a big chunk, but spark. Oh my god, another one? Go. Fuck yourself. Alright, well, we gotta heal now. 43! Overheat. Oh, uh, and it's not. It's not lowered either. Stop with your bullshit. All right, so special attack is finally dropping. No more white herb to save her ass. Torkoal can't move, so that's good for us. We're going to go for the spark. Spark again. And spark it up until you're fucking dead, Flannery. Fuck you. Killing our swallow like that. Oh, I guess I was trying too hard. Yeah, shut the hell up. I don't want to read your thing no more. We lost a Pokemon because of you. Hurt my feelings. Well, now we can go get our Route 111 Desert Encounter. Oh, that's cool, I guess. Oh, yeah, I forgot. We got to put our Pokemon to rest. <laughs> so sad. It's a sad day. It's a sad day when this beautiful Pokemon just get put in the death box. Well, what are we going to do now? <sighs> Wednesday, what's the matter with you? Alright, well, I guess we're stuck to one flying type now. We have a water type here, we have an electric type, we have a fighting type. We could have a normal type, but I kind of don't want to use that thing. Um, I don't know. Kind of want to be mad about a dragon, but I want to get a trapinch if we get a dragon. So let's go see if we can get that. Twist his dick! Whoa, dude, it's the MMA fight. Twist his dick! All right, let's see what ground type or cacnea we get in here. And it's a trip pinch. It's exactly what we wanted. All right, fake out time. No, okay. Ooh, boy, I about to say you better not go down no more fucking knee down, but I tell you what, boy. I need you, man. I need you on the team. I need a dragon type. And then a dragon ground type? Fuck yeah. Don't worry. You don't have to worry about ice type moves. Why? Dude, do you see the guy sitting right in front of me? It's a fighting type. You say he looks like weak sauce? Oh, shit. Well, he's not going to like that. But let's go ahead and name you uh, Chomper. He looks like uh, he looks like one of the uh, things from Mario. They're called Chomper. So right, I'm going to go Chomper. All right, so I'm going to put you there and give you the uh, EXP share to hold. We're going to start leveling you up right the fuck now. All right, just go for the arm thrust. We're going to destroy this thing. That thing had Sandville. How annoying. Oh, I was going to say, let's go to Swellow for this one, but... We don't have it no more. Fake out. And then Fury swipes to death. We need to get a Giga Drain move or something. Oh, dude, stop. Jesus Christ. Trying right, to take out our Pokemon? We already lost one. Leave us alone, man. Leave us alone. Don't do that to us. Oh, yeah, the things are in there. All right, well, I'm going to run to this lady real quick so I can heal up. Boss Chingo. All right, 
Uh, let's heal up, lady. I got shit to do. So I can't take more than one nap. Hello, hello, and welcome to the stream. Whoever joined us, go ahead and say hi in the chat. Let's get that going. Oh, Baltoy said, fuck you. Crazy, I got two fake out users on the team. Oh, that would have been a good time to go to our flying type Pokemon, but we're stuck in fucking thing. Energy powder, you're gonna need it. Oh, I didn't do much. Alright. Oh, come on, dude. Dude. Thank you. <sighs> like these people. Like these Pokemon forget what the hell they're doing. Go ahead and swap this out. Let's go to Chomper. What are you doing? Fat ass. Just sitting there. Alright. Mirage Tower. We get an encounter in here too. And it's a trip inch. Uh, I'll switch out here. We have nothing for ground type Pokemon. I just realized. So I'm going to go ahead and just put Rakishi up front. Get our encounter and go. <laughs> Fake out. Let's see if we just catch it here. Alright, we're going to name it Sandic. Not Sandic, but you know, Sandic. Like Sonic, but Sand. What if we just name it Sanic? There we go. And now we're going to go ahead and put a Repel. So we don't run into any more wild Pokemon. Alright, here's the fun part. Doing this on an emulator is going to suck, huh? Shit. I'm going to use all my repels here. <laughs> Shit. Almost. We're getting there. Ha! Oh, I had it. Come on. Alright, well, y'all gonna see me uh, fuck this up a lot because uh, emulators are hard. <laughs> fuck off, dude. Ah, here we go. There once was a Pokemon trainer. He had a mock bike. He said fuck you and he was really good and he made it. Woohoo! All you had to do was sing the song. All you had to do was sing the song. Something, something. All right, don't go that way. All right. Woohoo! We made it. Fossil time. All right, guys. Left. Or right, right, or left, or left, right, left, 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 right, left, left, right. Um, let's see which one will we go for. All right, so left is the root fossil, cray dilly, and the right is the craw claw fossil. What should we go for? Ding dong, ding dong, ding dong. Alright, I'm just gonna go with the root fossil. Why not? Ah! The castle's collapsing. And just like that, it was gone forever. No, 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 turn around! Oh, you could have got the other one too. Can you 
Hit an item it? No? Alright then. Okay, let's see here. I don't really want to fight anyone here because I don't have a good ground type answer. So I'm just going to avoid all this right here, right now. And uh, I'm going to... No. I'm going to go straight to the next gym. All around the world as we know it, it's the end of the world as we know it, and I feel fine. I feel fine. I wish these Pokemon would stay out of my face. I wish I could fly, honestly, because I need to get all the way across the fucking map. Something, something else. Singing a song. Singing a song. All right, we're almost there, guys. Bear with me. And then we'll have another gym battle coming up right now. Also, everyone who's watching, if you haven't yet, go ahead and leave a follow. And uh, show that support. All right, so we're going to go ahead and uh, put Rakishi in the back for now because uh, top level here is 31. I think we're more than ready for that. And down goes Swallow. You know what? I need to go buy items. I need to buy items right now, right now, right here, right now. Because uh, I'm not about to get fucked by this. Okay, that's weird. The TV just turned on out of nowhere, but it's fine. It's fine. Um, we're going to go ahead and get 10 more. We have two nuggets to sell, so let's do that. We got a Stardust. We got, ooh, lava cookies for days. So let's go ahead and sell Burn Hill. Uh, we'll keep the full hill. Why not? Um, get rid of these revives because we can't use them. Um, excuse me. We're keeping the soft sand for sure. So get rid of these. All right, we're gonna go. Um, oh wait, this too. Okay, okay, all right, okay, okay, all right. And let's go ahead and give overheat to uh, Charmillion. Charmillion. Because Charmillion could really use it. It's one of those uh, best to use on the last Pokemon type deal, but you know. Alright, let's go ahead and see what this lady does. Ugh, Wigglytuff. Oh shit! Double Slap knocked Wind out of her ass. And down it goes. Um, alright. Well, that sus. Well, that sucked. <laughs> Um, I think I'm just going to train up Rakishi in here then. No point in uh, risking anyone else's life there. Yeah, go fuck yourself with your trick, your happy shit. Shit fuck boy. Dang. These Pokemon ain't playing around. They're fucking hitting. Okay, I am nervous. Jesus Christ. All these battles are intense as fuck. You, you would think normal Pokemon gym battle uh, is easy. No, it's not. Wait, why is it green there and then blue? Okay, it's just color. Just color scheme. I was like, oh, that's the easy path. 
the easier path, the better. I mean, it kind of is. All right. Well, that was all the gym trainers. So uh, if we're not ready for the battle, then we're fucked. All right. So let's just go straight. And time to fight Norman. We need a new electric type too, because Wynn is not a Pokemon here anymore. Fine, as promised, I will have a Pokemon battle with you. Joe, I am happy that I can have a real battle with my own child. But a battle is a battle. I will do everything in my power as gym leader to win. Joe? <coughs> Dad, have you been drinking? You better give it your best shot too. Don't tell your mother. Oh boy, oh boy, oh jeez, oh my, oh Jesus, 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 oh my, oh my, oh my, this is going to be a scary battle. All right, Leader Norman sends out Spinda. Okay, this isn't scary. The worst thing it could do is teeter dances. Okay, it could do that too. Holy shit. All right, bulk up again. Of course, of course, of course, of course, of course. So Psybeam. Sorry, I'm speeding up. Sorry. Alright. Use Teeter Dance. Already confused. Breakthrough. Just break through, please. Just break through. Break through. Break through. Break the fuck through! Alright. We got two bulk ups up. I'm confident with that. So this is what we're doing. We're going to Super Potion. All right, teeter danced again. It's fine. Now we're gonna lava cookie. Became healthy. Cybeam. Okay, it's fine. Dickhead. Oh my god. Lava cookie. No, you know what? Heal first. Now lava cookie. Lava cookie. Fucking lava cookie. Dude, fuck off! Swear to God, if you get confused again, I'm gonna smack the shit out of you. Just break through. Just fucking break through. I'm tired of this shit. Break through! Boy, this is gonna be a fucking battle and a half. That's fine. Don't confuse. Spin to finally goes down. Fuck you. And your goddamn confusion antics. Fuck yourself. Alright, Vigoroth is coming in, which is not going to be good because we're going to take a couple of hits, so we're going to have to heal up again. But at least we're plus two defense. Alright, so hopefully we can heal up there. Alright, cool. We're at full, almost, one under. Slash comes off taking no problem we're plus two um arm thrust time we're gonna have to take a hit facade does nothing so i feel a little bit more comfortable critical hit hell yeah i feel a little bit more better about taking two hits from slacking oh light noon okay is this a belly drum set because if it is fuck you Yep. Belly drum. And arm thrust, baby. Let's go. Get the fuck out of my sight with your belly drum. Ho ass. That's why it's called hoeing, because this hat this asshole is hoeing me right now. With all them fucking T 
teeter dancing bullshit. Um, and then slacking's here. We're plus two on the defensive side. I'm gonna heal up. He's truant, so okay, counter. Beautiful. So now we can arm thrust here. Jesus Christ. That only did two. Loafing around. Okay, he's gonna get a berry. I'm gonna bulk up again. Because I'm not trying to take a counter to the face. Ha ha! Dick kid. Our dad sucks. You know that? Boom! Critical hit. And down slacking goes. Woo! Thank God. That was annoying as shit. Sorry, guys. I lost my cool a little bit there. Thank you for sticking through with that battle. And we have earned us a nor normal gym badge. Uh, I can't believe it. Y you just didn't attack when I was able to attack and my counters were just useless. Yeah, it's called using an attacking move, you dick. Joe received the balance badge from Dad. With that badge, the defense of all your Pokemon will increase. Pokemon that know that HM Move Surf will be able to travel over water. This is my gift to you, Joe. I am sure you can use it correctly. So he gives us facade, and then we get pulled out. They thank us for helping Wally, and we get our HM03 for surf, and we can finally surf. Alright, let's go ahead and give Table Surf, because it needs a Water-type move for sure. So we'll get rid of... Let's get rid of... Fuck it, let's get rid of Fury Swipes. Facade can go to... Honestly, Rakishi would be the best Pokemon, but... I don't know. I don't know, man. You don't want it. You don't want it. He, is, he has a full moveset already. Um, let's go Chomper to the front. We're going to go get us a new freaking electric type because Minin got killed. And maybe as far as I thought it would. And then Wismer. I'm going to put back in the box. It's just taking up a slot. Um, Take that from you. Okay, we have a ground type and Trapinch, so we don't need that. We also have a dragon type, so we don't need that. We could use... You know what? We could use a, a bulky poison type. And then... Um, I think that's good for now. I don't care for any of these other typings. That way we have a ground resist as well and fart. We won't be using them much, but after I get uh, Trapinch up some levels, we'll put the EXP share on them. Work a lot better. And I'm going to look up where you get Bullet Seed in this game because I kind of need it. Alright, and next levels for Jim is 33, so don't let me forget that. So someone just go ahead and put in the chat the levels of the next gym is 33. And I'll go ahead and remember based off that. Oh, thank you, thank you. Um... Where do you get bullet seed and emerald? Talk to the person to the left. 
on Route 104. Alright. Let's go out of our way a little bit. Um... Did I put bullet seed on what's his name? Oh, I hope I didn't. Septile. Oh, she gave us a white herb. Oh, there we go. Bullet seed. Boom! And just like that, low tad is viable again. Saw it on who? No one. Not gonna do that yet. All right, low Ted, go ahead and take us where we need to go. Bullet seed, and there's a lot of water trainers, so. Here we go. Story time. Let's see. Can I think of a story? Can I think of a story? And I know I got... I, no, I... Uh, yeah, get away from that. Fuck off. Okay, I need a repel. Story time with Joe. Alright, well, we can talk about... The one time I held up all of recess from going back to class. So. Won't get in trouble for this now, obviously. Because my my kindergarten teacher or first grade teacher or whatever. Whatever grade I was in. Ain't gonna remember this. But, um. Basically, I pretended my friend tied me to a. Well, I didn't pretend because he did. We, we were. I was tied by a string, and um, but obviously not hard. I mean, I was able to get out of it. I just pretended I couldn't. And um, so basically, I held up all of class from going back inside from recess because I didn't want to go back in. And so me and my friend were like, "Here, wrap this thing around my uh, around my wrist and." Make it to where it's like I'm stuck here. So we're like, okay, cool. We did it. And the teacher freaked out and was like, oh no, you're stuck. And I was like, yep, I'm stuck. And then it took them like 20 to 30 minutes and they finally were like, someone go get some scissors. And by the time someone came back down with scissors, I was like, maybe I can just get my arm out like this. And I got it off and she was pissed. But it was hilarious because I wasted so much time from recess. I mean, oh well, yeah, from being in class because we were still out there during recess. And um, yeah, I don't regret it. And that's the first time I've ever told that story to anyone. So don't go telling people. Because then my kindergarten or whatever grade teacher I was in is going to come back and haunt me. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and take down. Let's go surf here. And Ember. So in this generation, surf is not supposed to hurt your fellow Pokemon. So if it does, I'm going to call Mulligan. Because I don't remember it hurting your partner Pokemon in this generation. So Sandshrew and what's his name goes down. And we good to go. Natsu still alive. Woohoo! Alright, so we got another Sandshrew to deal with. So that's where we're gonna surf. And then we're gonna go out to Rakishi here. So 
So Sable's gonna hit that thing. Sanctuary's gonna go down. And then Wingle's gonna water gun me, probably. Or missed. That too. And shit. Not not fake out with you, Table. Bullet seed and fake out with you. And that way it goes down, no problem. Easy peasy. Found a big pearl. And honestly, oh shit. I'm going to go back real quick to um, Mauville. Shit. Leave me alone. This isn't cool, man. Fuck off. Well, this doesn't count. <laughs> I'm just trying to run away here. Rakishi. Let's go. Alright. We are on our way to Mauville City because I need a electric type. Jesus Christ. All right, well, um, let's go ahead and make our way this way. Make our way to Mauville City, where uh, the electric gym leader needs our help. snacks oh, I thought you got them for me cuz you love All right. diggity diggity ew that's old I know Sorry guys, quick break, but I'm back. <laughs> Sorry guys, just give me one minute. Close enough. Jesus Christ. All right, and I'm back. Welcome back. Well, thank you. Let's go ahead and go to my view. I'll get Thunderbolt as well. Yes, I'll do your I'll do your bidding since you're too lazy to do it. Break free, break free from that bullshit. 
Excuse me. Jesus Christ. All right, so our first encounter is a Magnemite. Going to go ahead and faint attack. Jesus Christ, this is not good. Go to Rakishi here. Get a fake out off. That'll do it. Let's go ahead and throw a great ball at this thing. Well, we're trying not to kill it, and it's over here like Sonic Boom. Like, fuck off, dude. Alright, and we're going to go with Magneto here. Magneto. And we're going to go get some uh, healing items. Because if I remember correctly, I have none. Dude, fuck off. Oh my god. That does not count. I'm trying to get away. Alright, let's go ahead and get some healing potions. Get about fucking 20. Let's go ahead and come this way as well. Can we get flamethrower? No, not that. Flamethrower. I want flamethrower. Ah, 500 short. Oh well. It is what it is there. Alright. Let's go ahead and do this real quick. Magnet pool. That could be interesting. Alright. Here we go. We're going to shut down this thing. Give a sand tomb. Just don't self-destruct, please. If you self-destruct on, on this thing, I'm going to destroy your life. Okay. Alright, this is what we can do. We can give you the soft sand to boost your ground type moves. Should have probably saved dig for him. <sighs> Literally, fuck off. These wild Pokemon are too strong. Jesus, there we go. Ignore that. Yeah, I'm just... I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to deal with it. Um, I thought that'd be a good place to train them, but it's clearly more annoying than anything. Alright, we got that going for us. So we can go this way. Ooh, Ultra Ball. Take. Alright, we can't go that way. That's the exit. Escape rope. Of course. So we get fooled there. Alright, so repel. Shit. Again. Ah, oh, shit. We weren't supposed to push that button. So now we come around uh, this way. Arm thrust again. Now we get full heal. Add another repel. Jeez. Come around this way. Get this Thunderstone. Shut it off. 
And that's what we came down here for. Now we can leave. Ah, oh, we gotta push the button again. Get out of my life. All right, now we run for the hills. Now we run for the hills and get out of here because we're done. And just in time. For us to spray another repel because we got to surf. Alright, well. Ooh, there we go. We finished that activity. And now we're going to talk to Watson. And we get TM24. Let's go ahead and teach TM24. Not yet. I want to see if we can get a magnetic. Avoid those. Fuck. Really trying to avoid that battle. There we go. Now we gotta talk to Steven. I forgot about that. Hi, Joe. It's me, Steven. We met in the cave near Dufud. Have you met many kinds of Pokemon since the last time I saw you? There are many, ki many, many kinds of Pokemon in this wide world of Oz. If you wanted to raise only your favorites, that's fine. Perhaps you find it more fun to raise all sorts of Pokemon. As a trainer of Pokemon, what do you think? Of course, it's not any of my business. I just wanted to ask stupid questions. It would be nice if you were to meet if we were to meet again somewhere. Alright, and nope, Zigzagoon. Alright, come on, my electric. Come on out. I don't want a Zigzagoon. There we go, Electric. There we go. Fake out. No! Critical hit! Bullshit! Well, we lose that encounter because of that. So now we just come back this way. We're going to heal up. Make sure everyone's good to go. And that's going to be a stream for us right there guys so thank you all for watching that's it for this episode of emeralds we're gonna be back later tonight in about 30 minutes to meet up with david and we will be doing our other stream um hopefully it's the cage lock and if not we'll be having some vgc battles for you guys so i'll be back see you on a little while and for those watching on YouTube, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.